Hello, I'm Cristina Marujos and you're watching the Daily Market Comment at XM.com by Rafi Boyajian. The US dollar was trading close to Friday's highs today when it surged on the back of a much better than expected non-farm payrolls report. The impressive data suggests the American economy still has plenty of momentum and is far from needing aggressive intervention by the Federal Reserve to bolster it. The dollar index jumped to a near three-week high on Friday, while against the yen, the greenback was comfortably back above the 108 handle. There were no escapees from the dollar's comeback, which triggered a negative correction in other majors on strengthening expectations that the Fed will soon engage in extensive policy easing. Equity traders were clearly disappointed from the unexpected improvement in the U.S. labor market. Wall Street's leading share indices closed marginally lower on Friday, but Asian stocks took the brunt of the beating today from the diminishing odds that the Fed will cut rates by as much as 50 basis points at its July meeting. Most Asian bourses fell by between 1 and 2.5 percent, though equity futures were pointing to a more modest losses for European and U.S. stocks. Treasury yields rallied from strong U.S. data, which in turn weighed on gold, which briefly dipped on Friday before recovering slightly. But with most world central banks still expected to move towards more accommodative policy in the coming months, sentiment for gold remains bullish and investors are still fully pricing in a 25 basis points rate cut by the Fed later this month. This puts all the more focus on this week's semi-annual testimony before Congress by Fed Chairman Jerome Powell on Wednesday and Thursday. The congressional hearings could be Powell's last chance to tone down market expectations of lower rates before the next policy meeting at the end of July or to signal that a cut is a done deal. Also worth keeping an eye on later this week are planned trade discussions between U.S. and Chinese officials as negotiators attempt to get the stalled talks back on track. However, expectations are low that any substantial progress can be made this week. This was today's Daily Market Comment at XM.com. Have a great week.